This time we're going to be sketching y equals x squared take away 4 over x squared take away 5x. So let's see if we can factorise the numerator and denominator first. So the numerator is the difference of two squares, so that's x minus 2, x plus 2. And the denominator factorises to x, x take away 5. OK, so first of all, vertical asymptotes. They're going to exist when x is 0 and x is equal to 5. So I'm going to try and make that as prominent as possible. So x equals 0 and x equals 5. OK. Right, uh, how about where it crosses the x-axis? Well, that's when y is 0, when the numerator is 0, so that's at 2 and minus 2. So at 2 and minus 2. Now, obviously, it's not going to cross the y-axis uh, because when x is 0, the denominator is 0. OK, so we're not crossing the y-axis. How about for a horizontal asymptote? So if I divide top bottom by x squared, I get 1 take away 4 over x squared over 1 take away 5 over x. So as x tends to a positive or negative infinity, uh, those two fractions are going to tend to 0 and we're going to tend towards 1 over 1. So this tends to 1 as x tends to positive or negative infinity. So y equals 1 will be a horizontal asymptote. So now what I would want to do is I would then want to figure out where it crosses the horizontal asymptote. So I'm going to put x squared take away 4 equal, sorry, over x squared take away 5x equal to 1, the horizontal asymptote. So multiply up, take x squared from both sides, divide through by minus 5, and we're going to get x is equal to 4 fifths. So x equals 4 fifths is where it's going to be crossing so somewhere there, for that to be 4 fifths, so that's where it's crossing y equals 1. OK? So, um, if that's the case, then that tells me that the curve must be coming down this way. OK? So it must be coming down through 4 fifths. That's bad. Oh, dear. 4 fifths through 2 and then tending towards the other asymptote. Oh, now I've crossed the asymptote. It's not very good. Just got to be careful. OK. Something like that. Right. OK, so how about the other parts of the graph? Well, over here, we must be coming up from this direction in order to cross through at minus 2 and we're not going to be crossing through the horizontal asymptote again because there's only one point of intersection and so then it must just tend towards y equals 1 and to the right of x equals 5 we can't be down below because we can't cross the x-axis there and so it must look like that okay and it's not going to cross the horizontal asymptote here either because 4 fifths is just the only point of intersection and so this is what the curve must look like. 